Hello there all you beautiful people and welcome to today's video. I am Dan, your friendly in the game Viking and today we take a look at Close Contact by Ryan Yavashnir. Hope I pronounced that right, but this is probably the smartest idea or the most stupid idea I ever had because we are gonna play an indie short horror game. So that takes place in space, so let's check it out. Look at that. Look ma, I am in space. So I think the scene is that we're supposed to be in cryo sleep waking up and something bad has really happened on the surface. I think it's gonna explain it hopefully. We'll see. Forget to mention, grab your cup you know and fill it with your favorite beverage. We might need it. Let's see here. Initializing ocular implant. Thank you very much. So what can we do with these? Initialization complete. Ah. <clears throat> now I remember. Look at all the fishes in the world. So, ooh. Ah. Left click to open your eyes. That's right. And okay, how do we get out? Releasing cryo hatch. Thank you very much. Oh, this is it gives me a little bit of vibe from the what the, what the space game is called. I will surely remember it soon. Okay, so we can move around. Ooh. Uh Ooh ah ooh controls go oh, controls hover and right click to interact okay I'm not the best in space obviously but let's see okay we can interact with those location based message begin Welcome to Cadmus Thank you You are about to join a team of scientists tasked with studying the unique biochemistry of the planet. After boarding the shuttle, you will begin to descent onto the surface of the planet, where a lift will take you down to the underground base. Upon arrival, you will be met by several members of the team who will take you to your living quarters where you will be permitted to rest. You will then be briefed on any updates that have occurred since the start of your cryo sleep. Your employer number is 18. 18. We look forward to you being a happy and valued member of Abbotsfield Corp. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, how do we descend into surface? Looks really good. And the reason, the reason I wanted, uh, sorry that I'm speeding around. The reason I wanted to play this game was because I saw a little bit about it, and people seem to have a little bit of problem of playing it and f solving the different riddles so I thought even if I'm the most scared person playing horror games I could probably solve this game hopefully that's why I say it might be the best or the worst idea I ever had I don't know really how to turn ourselves so we're gonna slide in this one Observation was the game. Oh, why do I tumble every time I go here? Oops. Hope you don't get seasick, by the way, of this. But we will get to the surface eventually. Upside down or... Wait. Okay. We're in. Initializing landing sequence. Thank you very much. So, I mean, for the indie game, it looks really good. Fins seems okay. What else could we check? Testing landing legs. Do they really do all that? Or do they just presume everything is working? I wonder that one. All 
systems good. But we are an employee of the mega corporation, so. Okay, so they might be waiting. Uh, but so far we haven't been told what the problem is, but we know that there should be, and since they built it... While we wait, here is an mm. interesting fact about Cadmus. Samples found on the surface of the planet, thought to be around 340,000 years old, contained DNA that is similar to that of a human. Of course they have built the space station, or their landing on the planet, over where some ancient civilization has of aliens lived before. I don't like that one though. Oh, that is not good. Shouldn't come sparks flying when we land, right? Nope. Seems like a mega corporation with some financial issues. Oops, I can twist my head. Oh yes. Uh, not anymore. Sad. So did we build that one or did they alien that inhabited it before? But this looks really good. Look at that. for some more coffee before the mayhem begins, right? And all of a sudden everything went dark. Why couldn't they build it on the surface? With no corridors and evil things. But it's a short game, it's supposed to be around one, one and a half hours of gameplay. But I think that's enough to scare me. If they ever get the landing thing. And no welcome committee, so you know that something went terribly bad. I don't think we are a rescue team though. You have now arrived. Thank you. We hope that you had a pleasant landing. It was a fantastic Please landing. Stay inside the shuttle. Someone is coming to get you. No, they're not. Let me know. There we go. Oh, it's almost looked like uh, Stargate when you, if you would come from the portal over there. And why am I moving by myself? Hello? Uh, escalator? Okay, no more moving. I will try to move as smooth as possible. Unless I get hunted, of course, but yep. Hold shift to run, thank you. And if we close our eyes... We can see all the hollow animals. And I think, if I'm not mistaken, we can listen to messages like this with our hollow implants in the eyes. Okay, so we stole their eggs and now they're mad and now I have to fix it. That is fab. Can we listen to this one? Uh, no. So let's see. We have lifts. Or lift. To command only. Let's see here. There's all the people here. 
still haven't met anyone locker room group employee 18 that's me if you would like a locker room to store your spacesuit please see laura frost oh, okay i'm guessing she got eaten by a uh, egg hunting alien but what would i know uh can we only go to that floor okay so i would guess that we have to return here to uh try to escape eventually but i have i have my headphones on loud because i guess that is what you need to do when you play these kind of games oh uh, this looks nice we have a big old whale there and uh, no evil things in sight so so far so good location based message begin Yes. If you get stuck, come back to these location based messages. Listen again. Okay. Right from there, you'll see another lift. You need to get to it. You're going to engineering. Yes. You have no time to do next. Okay. Was that all? Let's go to engineering. Because you have to step on this. Or I need to call the lift first. Engineering. The deeper we go. If you step on these blocks, you will eventually go where you need to go. So I step on engineering. And I will probably keep talking like this, just mumbo jumbo, because I feel safe then. It looks good. Feels good. And, ooh, look at the statues. They do love holograms or whatever it is. Location-based message, begin. Hmm? Ooh. Yes. If any of them dysfunction, you need to shut them off. After that, head to the control room and rear the power. If you get lost, follow the lines. Once the power is rerouted, go back to command. Okay. Sounds sounds pretty easy. I mean there's a horse here. No, it was a giraffe. Look at that. But that's not what we're looking for, we're looking for generators. There's an eerie sound. And if we go down here... Any bee down here though? He, she, it. Broken generators. My gut tells me that this one is broken. So let's uh, shut it down. Working. Working. What does this say? 502 off. Uh, let's run to this part. So far, nothing scares us. A little feel of aliens, kind of. Feel to it. Dark corners and stuff everywhere. And then we need to find command, I think it was. And I found the pool table. Where is command? Could it be there? Probably. Because this was space C. So let's see. Go to dog first. And we go upstairs. I like the lines here. Two guard dogs. Uh, let's see. Employee 18, do not use this terminal unless accompanied by engineer. Sorry, engineers has been eaten. If you are alone, you may only use this terminal as an emergency. All local hollows will be turned off during this process, and the door behind you will be locked for security and safety. Do it. So if I close my eyes... Ooh, look at that. And if I open my eyes, it's dark. Hello? If he's behind this door now, I'm going to be very sad. Holograms, come back. It's like a space flickering. But I still know it's dangerous music, so we are pretty safe. I say boldly, not knowing what's happening. Oh no, 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 no. No, no. No, no. I have two dogs there, they should protect me. 
No, what I basically know about this creature is that it's, as they said, it's attracted to our hollow implant in our eyes. So we're supposed to be able to close our eyes like this when he chases us. But, as of course, uh, if he, we, he won't avoid us, so we have to move. So if I stay like this, close my eyes and continue walking, I should be safe. Uh, where to then? Uh, command. I wonder if you can play the whole game like this. You should be able to, right? But I think the game will force us sometimes to open the eyes. So, we are back. And now we're gonna play the other one. And this is this one. Location-based message begin. Yes. Okay. Okay. So, nice bikes though. I wish I could drive that one, but we can't really interact with anything. Just to make sure of those. So the whole space by itself. Nice spiders, by the way. So we need to go to living quarters. And uh, let's see here. I mean, so far, and I'm gonna probably eat my words, it's not that scary. Hmm, way closer, narrow. Oh, he's gonna be here. I can feel it. I can't crouch, I can't. Oh, blinking lights ahead. Oops, sorry for that. Quick. Uh, this belongs to employee 7. So I'm guessing we need to figure out which employee uh, she was. The one with the password. So, let's see. Anyone going to the pocket must complete the new health and safety risk assessment. Of course. Mm, stop spawning hollow cats in the house. <laughs> Feels like my home with all the cats. The coffee machine is broken. Okay. That's sad, but I have my coffee over here. Friday night is quiz night. Uh, make sure you go to the med bay to have your implant checked. Please keep the course clean. Uh, found uh, toilet facilities. Nothing really. Mm. Do not write down your passwords or secrets on a sticky note. This is not secure. That means you employee 12. Okay. So employee 12 lives in shared room B. Location based message begin. There's a few people passwords that don't cross. I can't quite remember. I think employee 12 had the code of the crawler containing the egg that you need. Yes. Either for a fact she writes her codes down the old fashioned way. Just in case she forgets. Okay. So just to be clear. Shared room B. How do we find shared room B though? Uh, uh -huh. Frost? That was shared room A. Can we guess that shared room B is to the right? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> that was not funny. Okay, let's see how we can pass him, though. This could be interesting. That was a bit scary, I must say, but we are more well prepared this time. We do like this. C. Where the hell is A? B. Is he here? He's coming. One, two, three, five. Okay, now we just need to pass him again. So you know what? Mama raised no fool. 
Can we pass him like this? Whew. We are safe. I think we are safe. No one is scared. Uh, toilet facilities do not please. This one for those of you that would like to have a trip no running and stop spawning. Prepare space. The one thing I'm curious about is can we interact with these? Like why did the big door lift? So let's return here. Ooh. We're safe. I'm safe. I'm not scared. You are scared. We're going to lift. We're going to... Uh, mm, command. No, we're not going to command. Of course, we're going to... Mm. Now I can't see the other places. Yep. Out we go. I'm guessing we have to call that one again, right? Because it doesn't spawn the things. All right, all right. There we go. Living quarters done. Engineering done. Need to go down to the labs. This is gonna end badly also for all of us. Okay. But it's really good voice acting and so far... I mean, graphics looks really good. Let's see what he says here. Location based message begin. Okay. Wait here until I tell you to go. Okay. In here, before the last deck that we took, is in lab D. But you'll need the code for the overlook cooler. Mm -hmm. So I'll assume you already have it. Yes. You need to be very careful in there. One, two, three, five. The first game to take the egg. One of the creatures will try to get to it. The most will get the four rules, right? Lab G. No, why? That place looks good. Hey, hello. No, cat. No, cat, don't wait. Lab D. Lab F. So where are we going, kitty cat? Why can't it be... Why can't cats react to it like in uh, Alien? Why can't it be scared cats? Oh, that's a long way to run. And the cat shows me. Okay. So, the plan is that we find the alien, and as soon as we see it, we run back here and place ourselves over here where the kitty cat is. Close our eyes, move here, lock the door, and run outside. How hard could it be, right? Whew. I need a little bit more coffee for that. Okay. Let's go monster hunting. Let's go monster hunting. So when I see B, I turn right. Okay. And monster B behind door number one. No, he actually said it was a lab. So we need to find a lab. Lab F? Closed. Uh, lab E, closed. Christmas tree. Ah, uh, you can still keep it a couple of days, but not here, uh, at least here in Sweden. Oh, this looks promising. Does it do that on purpose that it's actually like a, a disturbance in the view? I must check, sorry for that. Yeah, because now I see pretty normal. But as soon as I get close to here, my viewing start to get fuzzy. So you must be here, right? Okay, deep breath. There, he was there. Oh no. Oh no, you don't. Uh, no, 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 no. We, I'm not looking back. I refuse to look back. I'm gonna run here. He's right at my tail. Two, 
If I open my eyes now and he's not in there. Whew. Okay. No need to wait for him to get out, because obviously he can use doors eventually. Ooh, he's mad. We're gonna run over here. Location-based message begin. These things are really heavy. Be careful. One, two, three, five. Oh, one, two, three. Oh, he's gonna eat me. Give me egg. No, no. Uh, how do I get out of here? Where's my elevator? Uh -huh. So now we can calmly investigate the spiders, I think. Oh, he's still screaming though. I don't like screaming aliens. And my pulse, uh, it's pretty, I think it's pretty normal, hopefully. Trying to check my pulse. Okay, can he be here though? Can he move from there? No, no. Nice palm tree. So... Will you help? Yes. Permissions updated. You are now authorized to enter the pocket. Huh? Spiders? Oh no, not the spiders. Okay. Uh, what's next though? Uh, next we have the egg. Uh, and now we can go to the pocket. So, basically, I will just run around again. Seems like touching one of these spiders updates your uh, access granted or whatever. And the pocket is opening, actually. So, uh, let's see the pocket. What is the pocket? Ah, it's where we have to return the egg. I think. Ooh, I, start, I almost drank all my coffee. This is stressful. It usually lasts me the whole gameplay. Uh, no, no. Location-based message begin. Okay. You don't want to tell me anything else? Location based message begin. Again? I have the egg. It's dangerous and risk. Yes. Is that it? You want like maybe there? Location based message begin. Oh. Oh. Is that it? No, like, uh, nice to meet you, uh, go this way, close your eyes often. No, nothing like that. This is so bad, but there's something over there. Oh, uh, no, no. You know, don't scream at me. But they can dig through rock. Uh, so they're gonna jump out of here, so I have to run? I can hear them. Okay, that's it. We're running. They're gonna eat me anyway. I'm gonna run. I'm focused. To stay alive. Oh, uh, nobody remembers the chicken, right? Uh, so we're running. Why are we running? Now why isn't this door open? Ooh. Okay, we made that one. No. It's like when in Alien when they go down to the 
Is it the second one where they go to the lair of the queen? It feels like it. Like a lamb going to slaughter. Oh, come on. No more screaming. Oh, yes. Now they can eat our elevator also. Oh, bad. Oh, now what? Ugh. Well, I have the egg. Can't I just take the egg and be happy? Like peace offering. Unless it's in, like the air, eggs in Alien. Did I die? Did I make it? Oh, we're going outside. Oh, welcome to Pandora. Okay. Just realized <laughs> I just realized I can jump. That's fantastic. Okay. Can can we close our eyes and navigate? No, we cannot. Is this a safe spot? Uh, but what? Okay. We're not gonna fall down the hole again, and we can jump. That is fab. So let's see. Yes. Yes, they are. Yes, no, we don't. We can go home. But we shall not stray from the light, people. Don't ever stray from the light. Can we trick them into falling into holes? No. Can we pass here? No. We can get stuck, though. Can we jump over it? Yes, we can. Cool. Good to know. Location-based message begin. Yes, me too. too. Yes, we did. I would just like to say one thing. They haven't mentioned anything about how we're getting out. If the aliens gonna accept us for doing that. And why are you screaming though? Let's take the high ground, shall we? Peekaboo! Peekaboo. Peekaboo. No? Hello, Mr. Alien. Alien. Oh, now he sees me. Can he climb up here? Yes, he can. But I am smarter than that. No stress. No, just being hunted in luminous caves. Location -based message begin. Oh crap. I don't remember the eggs being this far down. I think they may have been moved further into the cave. We have to carry on. What? Why do we have to carry on? Oh no. This is not good. For my sanity. Location -based message Why did, did they move it? Okay. And that's it? Oh, that is just fab. Oh, this is so bad. I can just feel that it's gonna be a group of... It looks like... Okay. Let's see what happens. Giant... Oh... Yes, hold egg. We can't do any... Yes, we can look. That's cool. I come in peace. I haven't talked really about the background music though. It's chill. You don't hear it a lot when they're screaming all the Oh. What is that though? I'm not scared anymore. Because I'm holding the egg. The egg that will stop them from eating me until I release the egg. 
then it would probably eat me as a snack. But when he's done, well, when we are done, what are we gonna do? Are we gonna send off the distress signal and then we'll just wait? Because in every catastrophic, like in the deep space or in like the dive down deep in the oceans, people always return and try to rebuild or restart what they did. So more humans are gonna be alien snacks in a while, I promise you. Egg? Anyone? Not the slight scary at all, shall we say? Is that the mother of all? And why do we have to go so deep into the cave? Here you go. So... Did we turn out into snacks or not? I don't know. That's a good question though. And what awaits us now? Because it seems like our implants failed and we can't do anything. So let's see. Yes, it's me. Huh? <laughs> Talk about interesting ending, I must say. Well, that was close contact. That was a really interesting short a bit scary game I must say, so I suggest you check out their steam page in the description below. I'm Dan and it's been a pleasure showing you this game. I do indie game reviews and indie gameplay videos, so until next time, stay safe and stay awesome.